and a happy new year. One of our most requested videos last year was to do the £100 challenge in Home Bargains. So I've got £100 in Christmas money here and we're currently in Home Bargains so we're going to have a look around. As with all my bargain shopping videos, I don't buy everything that I feature on camera and this is a prime example. Orange flavoured milk. You can get three cartons for 49p. Definitely not going to be trying it but if you have, let me know in the comments below because I'm curious. I've just found the perfect gifts to put away for Mother's Day. These are wine glass gift sets and they were originally £6. And if you look on the back, they covered this sticker up which said they were for Asda stores. So these were originally £6 in Asda. They're only £1.99 now. This one says, Mum, stop and smell the rosé. And this one is one Prosecco, two Prosecco, three Prosecco floor. Bargains for £1.99. The next item I'm going to be buying is this metal knit comb because the girls have gone back to school and already we have had a letter saying there's been a head lice outbreak so I'm going to use this to go through their hair every single night and if I do find head lice I will be buying the treatment from here as well because it's a lot cheaper than it is in the supermarkets and in stores such as Boots. Going to be purchasing these kids assorted plasters. They're 59p a pack and you get 30 inside and I think the owl design is adorable. We've just had a phone call from Callum's mum asking if we can pick up some cold and flu capsules and I've found these Beecham's ones for only 69p. Also going to be picking up these Norofen for children, they're only £1.59 and the retail of these are normally about £3.50. I'm getting these, I know you can get cheaper either booth them but my children prefer the taste of Norofen so at that price I'm definitely going to be getting one of these. I've just spotted this Revlon electric nail buffer and it's only $3.99 but the retail was $27.99. Home bargains weren't waiting around to get the Valentine's range in. As you can see they have a shelf full of it. They have some mug sets. They also have socks for 99p and this apron for $2.99. Do you like it Cal? Don't go baking my heart. I couldn't if I fried. Just bought these glitter fairy crackers and inside each one is a bath item. These were £11 down to £2.49 and next to it you have this DC Superhero Girls Travel Collection Toiletry Pack in a makeup bag and these are only £1.29. We definitely need some bleach holes so uh, what one are we going to get? I'm going to give this one a try because sure. it looks like a leading brand and sometimes they're made in the same factory. So for only 69p, we'll give this one a whirl. All right. Just found this adorable rainbow cushion for 4 dollars and it's covered in sequins. They also have sequin bows in different colours. These are 3 dollars And then moving down, they have these cushions, which are also 3 dollars just found two adorable mermaid products. They have this mermaid sleeping bag, which comes in a case, which is $12.99. And they also have this mermaid travel pillow, which is only $2.99. They also have cat ear muffs for only $1.99, and you can get them in pink or gray. For my bathroom, I'm getting two face cloths, which are 49p each, and also a hand towel for $1.99. I think this color is really pretty. Not sure how you pronounce this brand, it's either NU or NU, but this is laser copier and inkjet paper and it's really high quality, only at $2.99 and as I need printer paper desperately, I'm going to be buying both of these today. I've just found this unicorn egg cup and it comes with a cloud plate and it's not ceramic which I love because then the kids can't break it. It's made of plastic and it's a real nice design. It said the retail was $6.99 but it's only 99p. Only one left on the shelf so I'm getting that for myself. We are going to be spending the majority of our money in the grocery section because it's a lot cheaper than supermarkets. So first up we're going to get the heater kits. We do love Old El Paso and these are $1.99 each. We are also getting two large pizza bases. These are £1.9 and these OXO cubes, you get 24 for £1.49. Definitely need to stock up on Heinz tomato ketchup and the price is really good at £1.39 for 700 grams. So we're going to be getting four of these today. Our household go through tomato ketchup like crazy, doesn't it Cal? Oh yeah. 
buying a box of these LOL surprise eggs. They're similar to Kinder eggs, but inside you get a LOL pencil topper. I'm buying these because Molly and Bella now have a YouTube channel which you can follow. I'll put it on screen here, and they're going to be unboxing these. I want to do a lot of batch cooking this year because Callum has been working quite a lot at the salon. If you guys don't know, Callum is a massage therapist and sometimes when I'm having a bad pain day I just want a meal what I can quickly put in the oven which is already prepared. So I'm going to get these takeaway dishes here. They're 79p so I can batch cook and when I'm not feeling too good I can just put them in the oven and no preparation needed. Our plan when we come in here to spend £100 was to stock up with sugar-free Vimto because I go for it quite a lot. But look, they have none left. They only have a full sugar. So we can't do that. So we're still going to try to spend £100 and find something else we need. But if you do like winter spice Ribena, you can get it in here for only £1.29. And unlike the Vimto, they have loads on the shelf. Now we're going to stock up on some multi-packs of crisps and some cereal bars because we use them for pack lunches for Molly and Bella. If you guys didn't already know, you can get lots of fruit and veg at Home Bargains and the prices are amazing. Up there they have broccoli. Look how much broccoli you get in there compared to the supermarket. I'm actually going to get those because I want to make a roast dinner. We're going to be getting a box of large free range eggs and these are 89p. Just spotted this beef lasagna for £2.49 and Callum loves the Lidl's ones and they look pretty much the same so we're going to try one of those. Also getting some Vitalite which is 95p and these premium bacon slices which are £1.69. They look really nice. Also going to be picking up some trio biscuits for my dad because they're on offer for two packets for £1.50. But I think we're ready to check out. I'm not sure if we'll hit £100, but let's go and see. Yet again, I have failed to spend £100, but I do believe I would have done if they had the Vinto in stock, because we really needed to stock up on that. So we're going to have to go to Iceland, which is next door, to get the big bottles instead, which work out the same price. But are you new here? Let me know in the comments below. If you are, please hit that subscribe button and let me know where you think we should spend £100 next. Until next time, we will see you soon. Bye! Bye.